Hey, evening guys, welcome back to the channel. It's your boy Vexed again, and we are back with the uh, Suzuki Swift Cup on a Saturday night, hosted by Hodgy and sponsored by Hamburg Transport Limited. This is obviously the Ultima Recent League. This is a mixed bunch. We've got drivers from all different leagues here this evening. Obviously, only six drivers on grid this evening. Some of them couldn't make it, but after qualifying, this is how the grid stands. So Mikey is on pole, we got Vinny in second place, Smokey is there in third, Vex is fourth, Smurf is in fifth, and Pickle is in sixth. So without further ado, let's get into it. <laughs> Klaxon sounded, lights are out, they are off. Oh, was that in the background there? I think Vex got a really good start there, managing to go around. I think, actually, I think that was Vinny, and I think he had a false start. So back, Vex managing to make up two split places. He's still got Mikey on his outside. No, Mikey's dropped behind him. He's got Smurf to contend with as well. So Smokey Tom is taking up the lead of the race. I think actually Vex was knocked slightly there. I think possibly Smurf had a bit of a move on him. Back up to second place. Vinny is there in third place. We've got Pickle in fourth. Mikey has dropped to fifth, and we've got Smurf in sixth. Smurf now looking for a move on pick on Mikey. Is he going to get it done? I don't think he is this time around. He had a look, didn't he? But not quite close enough. Mikey trying to get onto the back of Vinny now. Vinny trying to stretch his legs a little bit. Pickles there. He's he's in the Domino's library. Vex still currently second place, and Smokey Tom. Smokey Tom has pulled out quite a bit of a lead now. I'm not sure how I managed that. I think there were shenanigans, wasn't there? There was some um, shenanigans around turn three, I believe it is. Or maybe even turn four, officially. But he's set, used it to his advantage. He started to make a bit of a gap now. If he can uh, keep it here, then he'll be laughing for sure. Had a couple of shaky rounds, hasn't he, Smokey Tom? He uh, had a couple of mishaps with his tyres and got the tyres slightly wrong on a couple of occasions. Had to go back in and rechange, which cost him a few places. And he's looking strong at the moment. Actually, Tom currently, I think he's League Three in the Citroen. BGT. His teammate is Firepower, one of our other commentators. Yeah, Smokey Tom. Smokey Tom's looking good for this one. And Pickle. Pickle's managed to find his way past Vex. And Vex dropping down a place now. He's down to third place. Pickle, he's up to second. He's got quite a bit of a gap now to Vex as well. It looked like Darry was starting to catch up in the background. Smurf is there, car number 13. He's still ahead of Mikey. So we've got four, five, and six. Smurf, Mikey, and Vinny. They're all quite close to each other at the moment, aren't they? They're quite, they're not too spaced out, but they have got a little bit of work to do to catch up to second and first. Vex, oh, there's a bit of contact there between Smurf and Vex. Smurf just going into the back of Vex slightly. Vex has lost them a couple of places. Smurf has waited for him. Vex actually diving into the pits now. Decided it's too dry on track for the wets. So he's going to get rid of them. Maybe trying to go for the undercut on some of the other guys. Be interesting to see if it works around here. Sakuba so obviously being a minute, a lap average. Pickle with the current fastest lap for one minute, 1.436. Almost not getting my words out then. A pickle, he's on charge now. He's starting to catch up to Smokey Tom as well. I'm not sure if Smokey Tom has made a couple of little mistakes here and there as the track is drying up. He is on the intermediates though, so that should play into his favor. Pickle, also on the intermediates. And you can see he is starting to catch Smokey now. Putting in them purple sectors. Might be on for another fastest lap. 
and he does he goes 101.354 I wonder if any of these guys will manage to get a sub one minute lap. Obviously, in anything bigger than these Group 4 Suzuki Swifts, you are going to be looking at definitely sub one minute laps. For sure. In fact, I think, I think some of the other guys in the group can probably put these cars around here, I'm sure. Shame that Ice Chand and Wayne G aren't here this evening. Definitely two guys that couldn't have made a slow poke as well. Slow poke were missing from the grid. Mikey's a little way now, isn't he? Off of the back of uh, Pickle. Vinny behind him, so Smurf and Vex, they've got a little bit of catching up to do. Vinny currently fourth place. Smurf is fifth. He's got a bit of a gap now to Vex, but Vex is out on intermediates, so he's gone from wets to intermediates. I thought he might have gone for softs to be honest, but obviously opting for the intermediates this time around. I'm not sure if that's going to play into his favour or not, but we'll have to wait and see. As you can see, the lobbies are still fairly unstable. Hopefully Polyphony will get on that soon, because it is, as you can imagine, rather annoying and it doesn't make for great watching. Oh, we're also missing Hodgie, the boss. He's also missing this evening. He normally races every week, but I think he had a fishing out in. So we ditched us lads for uh, to go and chase fish. Fair enough. Why not? No, spending time with his boy as well, so all is well. All is good. Oh, and actually, yeah, there we go. So as the track is starting to dry up now, Mikey is putting a 57.6. I did say we were going to see sub one minute laps, didn't I? I wondered if we were going to. Obviously, the track is dry now, pretty much. So for some reason, my brain didn't compute it. It was wet before. <laughs> Even though the guys are out on the intermediates and wet, but... There you go. So Smokey Tom, he's now getting challenged by Mikey. Mikey's crept all the way onto the back of him and he's looking for a move. Trying to go a long way round. He's managed to get a switch back. That was a great move there from Mikey. Smokey Tom, he's going to have to stay with him now, isn't he? Oh, so Mikey, Mikey actually going for the softs and he's made them work. Smokey Tom now into the pits. He's going to get rid of the intermediates, possibly take on it set of slicks oh it's Pickle Pickle has a moment he's gone wide that's let Vinny through Vinny's moved up to second place Vinny on the mediums obviously any tyre on offer this evening being a wet race so with conditions you have to run wets or intermediates anyway so the guys can choose to run whatever slicks they choose or they want to use so Vinny, he's moved up to second place. Pick, we had that moment, didn't he? He's on very worn in immediate. So now you can see that on the tyre graphic on the bottom left. Still trying to get them pizza deliveries done. Smokey Tom, he's emerged in fourth place. He's actually gone for the intermediates. I think that might have been an error there from Smokey Tom. I think maybe he wanted to go for the slicks, but you never know. Maybe you've seen something the other guys haven't. It could be that there's another weather front on the way. Vexed, Vexed now moved up to fifth place and his wipers are going. So I think it is, yeah, you can see the graphic on the bottom left there. It is going wet on track again. Although he may have used them too much of them intermediates now. He may have to pit again. So maybe strategy not quite working out for Vex this time round. Currently in fifth. And Pickle, he has actually dove into the pits now as well. So we have got Mikey. Mikey still in the lead of the race. He's out on them softs though, isn't he? And it is getting wet on track. You can see he is starting to struggle for grip. I think he's going to do his utmost to make it work. He's very brave though, isn't he? In fact, it looked like not too bad through that sector. So maybe only raining on certain parts of the track. Oh no, he's had a moment, he's had a moment on the last turn, that's the final turn on the approach to the start finish. Just going a little bit deep. 
I think he wanted to pit there, to be honest. I'm not sure why he stayed out, or maybe the rain stopped. In fact, his wipers aren't going now, so perhaps the rain has stopped, or as I say, maybe it's only on certain parts of the track. Meanwhile, Vinny, Vinny's out on medium still as well. He's actually crept up onto the back of Mikey. That little error that Mikey made on the final turn, that's let Vinny get onto him. me there from Vinny through that last sector but so yeah you see Vex he has gone in again I'm not sure what tyres he's going to come out on Smurf has managed to take that fifth place away as he has gone into pit and you can hear the rain now you can hear it it is coming down so these guys on the slicks I think they're going to be thinking about pitting as Vinny does go in so Vinny's gone in Mikey stayed out he is favouring track position. He's trying to create a gap to the rest of the guys. He's currently got the fastest lap of 57.3. But see how much that lap time has dropped off. On them softs in these wet conditions. And he's gone deep. He's gone deep. That's unlucky. That's unlucky, Mikey. He's still going, though. He's not spun it. He's not, not lost too much time. In fact, Vinny diving into the pits. He's got rid of that medium. Smokey Tom, he has gone through to second place. He is already on intermediates. Vinny, Vinny's come out behind him. He's on a fresh set of, set of intermediates. Pickle, he's on an intermediates. Smurf, intermediates, currently fifth. And Vexed, at the back of the pack, he's in sixth. Still some decent points though, because as I say, not many drivers turning up tonight, so some nice points for these lads. Be interesting to see how the tables stand after this round be in round four. Oh, Mikey, Mikey, he's had a big moment. Big moment there from Mikey. Smokey Tom's gone through. He's actually got a 0.5 second penalty. Not, we didn't see what that was for. I'm imagining it would be for track limits, so he probably went a little bit deep into one of, the, one of the turns. The game obviously thought that he was trying to cut the track limits, but I'm sure that isn't what happened. Oh, with Smokey Tom. Smokey Tom's made an error. He took up the lead of the race. He's made an error on the final turn. Vinny has gone through. Vinny Van Gogh, he's a new race leader. Currently on the intermediates. Smokey Tom has caught back up to him, though. He's not lost him too much, has he? Or it didn't cost him too much time. That slight error that Smokey had. Still looking to challenge Vinny for that first position. And it looks like he's turned to full wet conditions out there, 12 minutes in, 12 and a half minutes in. Be interesting to see if the guys start struggling on intermediates and have to make a pit and take the wets on. Actually two 30 minute races this evening. I think it's gonna be around about 30 laps, give or take. So Vinny, still in first place, Smokey Tom not too far behind him in second place. Does it look like he's starting to get a little bit sketchy out there? Pickle. He's actually not too far off him as well, so the top three. All not too far from each other. Smokey Tom looking like he might be able to challenge Vinny in a lap or two if he uh, stays with him. Pickle, he's got a little bit of work to do to catch up to the front two, but not too much. Only a couple of seconds behind. It is very well there now though. Mikey, Mikey's in fourth, oh, as he gets the rear end out, drifting that swift. Who said front wheel drives can't drift? To be fair, they use them for rallying though, don't they? So, what I imagine probably converted to, they be converted to front wheel drive, uh, four wheel drive even. So yeah, Mikey, he's, he's currently in fourth place. He's about 10 or 12 seconds, I say, off the rest of the pack now. In fact, that might even be the price of a pit stop. So there's Pickle. Pickle's actually gone in. 
I think he's thinking of changing tyres, going for the full wets, but it looks like it stopped raining out there. Smurf, he's currently fifth. He's doing well to hold on to that fifth position at the moment, top five. Will he get past Pickle? Stay on board and find out. So no, he hasn't. Pickle's come out just ahead of him, not too far down the road. So he is starting to catch him now. Meanwhile, Vexed, he's only just approaching the final turn now. So I think having a few moments this evening, Vexed. I think getting his tyre strategy slightly wrong as well, going for the undercut didn't really pay off for him. And that's the price you pay, but still, good points. Vinny, Vinny's still currently the leader. Smokey Tom, Smokey Tom is starting to look like he might be able to push and start challenging him. Pickle, he's actually out on the wets now, and that may be an error. Obviously, he emerged, didn't he, or re-emerged behind Mikey. Mikey taking out that third position when uh, Pickle stopped to change his tyres, but I think, I think that may possibly be an error from his strategist. They put him on the wets, but it does look like the rain has stopped, and the track is starting to dry again. In fact, it even looks like the sun is trying to come out. So that may that may cost Pickle in the long run. It was looking like it may have been a great strategy decision decision to start with, but at the moment it's not quite paid off for him, is it? He's going to be starting to look to cool them tyres down, I'm sure. Oh, it's Mikey. Mikey's actually dove into the pit, so Pickle is going to get back up onto the third podium slot. He's moved through there. Mikey's dropped to fourth place. Is Gary going to get through as well? Not sure. Come around the final turn. I don't think he is going to quite get past Mikey. Oh, in fact, he does. So Smurf actually taking up fourth place. Having a great race at the moment in Smurf. Trying to make the most of the points on offer. Looks like he's settled in nicely into this race now. A little bit off the back of Pickle, but we may catch up with him. So Mikey, Mikey's currently in fifth place. He's actually back out on racing softs. He's got Vex behind him on the intermediates. So that pit stop, that late pit stop, that's brought Vex back into play. Possibly. Although Mikey is on the faster compound, so... If he manages to make it work, stays on the dry line, doesn't have a cropper, or doesn't come a cropper, then he should, in theory, pull away from Vex quite easily. 
basically wanting to try and stay with him, use the most of that slipstream and try and get onto the back of the rest of the pack, but I think it might be too little too late in this race one. If this is your first time watching, this is the Ultimate Racing League. You can check us out on Facebook. We run several different leagues. We have a fun, well, I'd say a fun league. It's still quite competitive on a Saturday night. Uh, fr uh, Friday night, sorry. Uh, it's currently Flash's GT. I think it's GT500. And then on the Saturday night, we've currently got the Swift Championship. This Swift Cup here that's running. And then on the Sunday, we have the uh, the Serious League Racing. With four leagues currently. You can check out the other commentators. YouTube, check out Ice Chand on YouTube. URL Firepower, his channel is just called URL Ultimate Racing League. He posts his uh, videos to there. And then we've got URL Paulie72. And I believe his channel is Paulie72's racing channel on YouTube again. And obviously we've got a lot of guys who stream as well. Smokey Tom being one of them. Bex is currently sixth place. Try to stay with Mikey, isn't he? But unsuccessfully so so far. Vinny Van Gogh still currently first place. He looked like he had a bit of a moment back there, but I think it may be the lag within the lobby. Definitely shenanigans. No, they are starting to try and cool their tyres down now. As they are in the final stage of this race, I think the guy's probably not wanting to pit. Did look like Pickle and Smurf. They've actually gone in, haven't they, to try and get rid of them wet weather tyres. Whether it'll pay off for them or not, though, I'm not sure. They've currently lost, well, I think Smurf. In fact, Vexed, he had gone through to fourth place, hadn't he? But... I think Pickle coming out just ahead of him, he's now on the uh, racing softs, so looking to pull away from Vex now. Vex, he's actually decided to take a very, very late pit. Eight minutes left, just under, and he's gone into the pits. I reckon he's going to be trying to take on the uh, softer compound tyre as well. In fact, Smurf, Smurf's gone in as well. I'm not sure what happened there. Maybe Smurf again to change his tyres, not too sure. Smokey Tom as well. Last of the late pitters. So Vex is in, Smurf's in, Vinny Bank off. He's still out. He's on the intermediates, trying to call him intermediates down. He's moved back over onto the racing line. Who's that going to come out behind him? There was someone coming out of the pits there. I was vexed. So Vex coming out behind Vinny. But Vinny's still on the worn intermediates. So Vinny actually lapping Vex there as Vex came out of the pits. But Vex, he's, uh, he's on very fresh softs now, I believe. It's actually starting to look like he's gonna looking like he's trying to challenge Vinny. Obviously only able to unlap himself, but why not? Might be worth a shot. Smokey Tom. Oh Smurf has a bit of a moment there. I think that was turn five. The approach to turn six now. Smokey Tom, second place currently. Mikey still the fastest lap of 57.3. I want it out to be. Is it starting to rain again? I think I can hear rain again. Mikey, he's decided to dive into the pits. He's left it to the last minute. 
obviously the pits closing at five minutes towards the end of the race. Oh, big ol', big ol', he's bad some water. Yeah, it sounded like he wasn't going to get that car stopped. Oh no, no, he has gone deep. That's unlucky Pickle. So Pickle finding the wet stuff there. It has started to rain really late. Oh no, he's giving him a penalty as well. Just an insult to injury. Currently fourth place. I think he's going to go deep again. No, he's managed to control it, so... I think he's kicking himself now though because he's picked up that penalty for, for nothing. He literally went off track and picked it up. Looking like he's gone back to wet conditions, so the guys that are out on the softs, they're going to be kicking themselves, aren't they? Oh, and Vex, Vex is getting the move done on Vinny Van Gogh. He's going to get blue flagged, but why not? He's actually let Vinny retake it. In fact, I think he went deep. He's on the soft side, isn't he? So, Smokey on fresh intermediates. He's looking to try and get onto the back of Vinny, but he's got a little bit of work now, hasn't he? Vinny obviously staying out. He favoured track position. I think he fancies he can take them tyres to the end. So great tyre management skills there from Vinny. And Smurf is back in the pits again. Smokey Tom, Smokey Tom is currently second place. We've got Mikey, he's hit, he's up to third. Vexed is up to fourth. I think Pickle had a moment, and I think he's had another one I can see on the track map there. There he is, just rejoining the track. He's stayed out on the sauce, he's made a gamble. I think he thinks the track may possibly dry up again. He may get past Smurf, but I think Smurf is going to come out just as he comes past the pits. Smokey Tom now coming up to lap pickle. Closing right up to the back of him there. So Smurf, he's taking on a fresh set of intermediates. He's going to be trying to put them to work now. He's actually got a second's worth of penalty, so he's got that to contend with as well, but he might be able to catch up to fifth place. Pickles only a little way up the road. Meanwhile, Vinny, Vinny's in first place. Vex still playing with him. Still hanging off his bumper, desperately trying to unlap himself. Not too sure that it's going to happen though. Vinny moving over, moving over to cool his tyres down. Vex with a lovely switch back, finding the traction on the inside. Obviously getting blue flagged, but there's enough of a gap for him to be able to have a bit of a play with Vinny. Obviously on a Sunday night, he would be told to get out of the way. But at the moment, he's still trying to unlap himself. Vinny, Vinny back through. So even though not racing for position, great little battle here between these guys. Both guys moving over to cool their tyres. They've moved over onto the wetter part of the track. Obviously with the dry line forming now. Vex looking around the outside. Vinny is surely going to come home in first place, isn't he? He's got a great gap now to the rest of the field. Vex desperately trying to hold on to that fourth place and try and make up any more places he can. I don't think he's going to be able to catch up to Smokey and Mikey though. Smokey, he's got a bit of a gap now to uh, to Vex and Vinny up ahead, but currently second place we've got Mikey. He's got a way to go as well, hasn't he? As he comes around the corner, somebody's actually off track. I'm not sure. Oh, it's Pickle. Oh, it's unlucky Pickle. He's having some moments, isn't he, on that final turn. So vexed, he's still there in fourth place. Still, <laughs> still on the back of Vinny. Pressure in the race lead. Oh. <clears throat> 
getting the switch back done again. I think he's going to actually just try and create a bit of a gap now. Create a bit of space between him and Vinny so Vinny can bring it home in the first place. We'll go through the pack quickly as well. So we've got Vinny, Smokey Tom, Mikey, Vexed, Pickle in fifth. Smurf, he's in sixth. Then this is your race leader, Vinny. You see Vex just up ahead of him. I think that's going to be where Vex finishes, as he is just ahead of the race leader as he comes across the start finish line. So Vinny, he takes the ch no final turn. He takes the final turn, and he is surely going to take the checkered flag. So yeah, Vex comes through in fourth place. You got Vinny, he's in first place. He takes the checkered flag. First win for Vinny, race one. Smokey Tom, second place. Not too far off the back of uh, Vinny towards the end there as well. Maybe some of that battling the Vex, the pressure he was putting him under. Maybe that kind of slowed him down somewhat, but no sweat in the end. He managed to still take the win. Mikey. He's made it home in third place. That's the third podium slot. He's rounded off the podium, vexed in fourth. Pickle, he's gonna bring it home in fifth place. That's unlucky there from Pickle. Smurf, sixth. So unlucky race there from Smurf as well. Well, that was race one, guys. Hope you enjoyed that one. I will see you for the next one. I've been your boy, Vex. Good night.